All right, I get asked a lot this a lot. Why does my spacebar sound different on the right hand side compared to the left hand side? <clears throat> a lot of people will tell you it's wire balancing, a lot of people will tell you it's the stabs. And what I will tell you is first of all, your stab has to be flush and secure and not rattling. That's number one problem. Number two problem is if you're using a hot swap board, there's a socket here, there's holes here. It messes up with the sound. So you should go to solder if you can. So I'll give you an example here. I'll show you exactly what's happening here and why your space bars sound different on the right hand side compared to the left hand side. When you install the stab, you'll see there's wiggle here. See how it's wiggling? Let's try to show you. See how it's wiggling? That will not give you a clean stab. The way around that is you must use the stoppers. See this wiggle as it hits the PCB. You're going to get some crappy sound. That's if you ignore the stoppers. Now the stoppers are not just to make sure your stabs don't pull out, but they're to ensure that it's flush and straight on and solid connection to your PCB. So there's no wiggling. So I used to ignore these stoppers because I never had to pull stabs, but my stabs were always jiggling. So now that I've got the stopper in, you'll see that there's no play anymore. It's now flush, which is what you want. That's great. Now, here's the main issue. As this goes up and down, you will see there's a hole here. You can see the stab going in and out here. See that movement? That's the stab. So the stab, as you hit it, is pushing air right through this hole. You don't want that. You're making less contact with the PCB. There's no clack happening. Only half of the stem is touching the PCB. The other half is going right through the hole like a giant flex cut. Whereas you see on this side, it's solid. There's no gap or air here. The stab connects fully with the FR4 and clacks. This side, because of the hot swap, because of the socket here, and the hole here, because of the multiple uh, support 625 and 7U, you've got a big fat hole here. The stab's pushing right through. You're going to get different sound from this side. All right? This is what it's supposed to look like when there's a well-designed PCB. This is the PCB for the cloud line. Cloud 9. You see both sides. There's a stab here. No gaps, no holes. No gaps, no holes. That's why the space bar on this sounds very even on both sides on my Cloud 9. This, not ideal. Now, some people have asked me, should you tape this hole up and prevent some of this air flowing through? Maybe. I've never tried it. But that's likely the culprit. So number one, make sure your stab is flush. Number two, maybe tape this up. There's not a lot you can do. Don't worry about wire balancing. This is the number one problem right here. You have full PCB on this side, a big gaping hole on this side where only half of the stab is connecting and the rest is pushing through. So you're gonna get space bar that sounds weird on this side, solid clack on this side. 